In this video, I'll be showing you how to insert a cover page, contents page, and section breaks. Open up Word documents, simply go insert, cover page, and select the style you want. On that cover page, you might need to insert things like a title, word count, first name, second name, student number, center number, whatever. Then on the second page that appears, you then need to insert a contents page. So we go layout, maybe change the margins, references, and insert a contents page. Now, next section is how you insert section break because this will help you divide the page numbers and have accurate page numbers. So, layouts, breaks, next page. Down to the footer, unclick where it says link to previous, page number, insert what you want. So, you might want to change the stars, you can edit the field, or simply just cancel that. You need to go format page numbers, start at one. And now, insert the first chapter heading, in this case, the introduction. Highlight that. Go to where it says heading one and click that, maybe put that in bold, up to you. Press return, you can see it changes back to normal. Then if we control enter and type in the second chapter. And again, select heading. You can see that these two chapters have appeared and again, press enter to change to normal. Now if you go back up to the contents page, update table, you can see it automatically updates the chapter headings. Now. Let's say, for example, you want to change the style. There's two ways you can do this. So let's say, for example, I'll change the fonts. Now, you can either go into this feature and create a style, up to you, or maybe perhaps a simpler way of doing it is using where it says Format Painter. You highlight and click. Now, if you double click, you can continually change the formatting you want, and you can see Update Table again. And that's how you do it. Cover page, contents page, and section breaks.